Alright guys, welcome back to another tutorial brought to you by Chikorita Mudkips. Today we are going to be looking at... What's this? Um, today we are going to be looking at applying scripts. Um, you should know about events. There's people events, obviously. There's scripting events. There are warps. Um, and there are scripts. Scripts happen when you step on them. So today we're going to be working with this person event right here. So, we're going to write a simple script for this guy. He's a bug catcher, apparently, and um, yeah, he's a bug catcher, right, as you can see right there. So, to start off, we are going to uh, write a script. Now, I'm, honestly, I don't have any of this memorized. I have a thing that has all of them. Uh, every all the commands I don't I haven't memorized them I mean you may think I have but whatever so for the sake of this tutorial I shall be referring back to my own tutorial which can be found in the SOS Brigade um, you can see here I have basically a tutorial I wrote which will be helpful I mean I add to it every now and then every time I learn something new um, and learn it enough to tell you guys I post it here um, just thought I'd just throwing that out there. So, uh, we're gonna start off by inserting the script right here. Copy, paste. We're gonna change the message to yo 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 home slice in my hood. Whatever, don't really care. Um, you see here and here's what I made a mistake before kind of in this tutorial something I learned later N will double down the line because you can only they have a little box that you can um there's a little box you can draw in in Pokemon uh, that text comes up and so N this backslash right under the backspace key and N that will make it go to a new line and you can only have 30 characters in a line so let's go 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10 alright so I actually just make it but say if I were to say in my hood how's it going now I'm going to need that N but let's say how's it going how are you no any good stories alright so here we have a thing and you, you don't really want to put an N um, well you can put an N in the middle of a sentence but you don't want to put the one I told you guys to put which is a P which basically clears the entire box and starts over you want to put something that basically just shifts all the text up um, I got this flash document out here just to show you real quick like you have this little box in Pokemon where shit can go and you can only have 30 characters along here and then 30 characters along here so what I told you guys was basically what it did is it took everything in here deleted it and it started over it started right more but if you're in the middle of a sentence by here you don't want to do that you want to move everything up so what it's going to do is the command I'm going to show you is going to essentially have this bottom command still here this bottom right and then just keep writing more I don't know if you can really understand what I'm talking about but just trust me if so and you want to backspace so it's right up against the edge of this thing um, of this box you want it so it's right here if you leave a space it looks awkward it's like starts there um, so you definitely want to have this right up against and have no spaces there so let's just count this 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. So I ended in the middle of the word, so I'm going to go to the left to the nearest word, press delete the backslash thing again, and then I'm going to press L, and that just kind of shifts it. Um, I'm confident there's whatever. So now we're going to put a P there. Now we can keep typing how pi is good so now we have a decently long script right here but at the same time it's really really simple um, lock I haven't explained any of this org start this is what you put at the end of thing you put org and then something this doesn't have to be start this could be banana if I want I can go like this and call it banana 
I, in fact, I will do this. Ah, uh, sorry, I hit my mic. I will call this banana. So lock, base player, it displays message one, box at six, release, and end. So it's that simple. Message one will take you here to the message. And you can't do this. So let's say I want to put, let's say I want them to give you an item after the message. You can't go down to the message and be like, give item 66 one, which I happen to know is a carbose. Uh, you can't do that. You can't. It's not going to do anything. It'll The script will show him saying, give item 66 one. No. You're going to want to put it here. Give item 66 one. 66 1 but I'm not going to go into that right now <sighs> anyway for now so it goes to there box set 6 there are a couple type of box sets I know and I will display them here I love flash it's so epic so we have uh, oh I found my tablet pen all right so we have box set 4 5 6 um, I'm good. Cancel. Alright, so four. This, number four, it simply, uh, number four is, I'm just gonna, it does not close. That's what number four does. Does, doesn't close. It does not close. It will, the text will stay there, and that box will be there, and you'll be stuck. You can't do anything. It'll just be there, the text. You, you're stuck. Like, you, there's no way to move on. Now, why would they have a type of command? I will show you later, but for now, just remember, box at four does not close. Box at five is a little better. It, it displays a yes, no option. Now, Without a certain line, which I will go in more depth later, guys, but without a certain line underneath, so here we have, it, let's see if we change this to box set 6. Without a line right here that says something, whether you press yes or no, it will still just continue the script. So, there's a special command for that, though. And then box set 6 just closes. Closes on key press, or whatever button press. Closes on press so that will close all uh, when you press whatever the your key is that's the a or the b or whatever so that'll just close so that's what i'm going to use in this case box set six so it's just going to close this message when it's done displaying it and then release end so if you have so actually we're going to go file, save as, and you want to save it, I'm just going to save it on my desktop as an .rbc file. And you're going to want to save it as, well it doesn't really matter, I'm just going to go test. Uh, you're going to want to save it so you can find it later just in case you want to make changes to it. So then you're going to right click it. And if you have PokeScript, which is actually right here, I have it. If you have that, you're going to go compile script, it'll be there, compile script will be there. So this will come up, and this thing right here, buff right. So you're going to highlight from down to up, and you're going to go file destination, and you're going to find your ROM, and this is kind of awkward because I'm using my tablet pen. So now you're going to click assign, click this, and click right there. File, burn, go back to your offsets. Go into advanced map here. The first one, the very first one is the one you want to put and here they have script offset I assume you know about script offset it's right down here so we're gonna go eight zero zero one seven D capital D and we're going to go file save now if you have XSE and you selected it by going I don't know if it's settings or something you can press open script and it'll tell you it in XSE scripting, which is different than PokeScript. I think it's a little dumbed down, and I don't like it. I like PokeScript better. It's more classic programming. Um, so file, save. Um, I'm in nine minutes, so let's just see if we can test this out real quick, and that'll be it, guys. Um, shit. I'm gonna keep my time up just so I don't go over. Uh, okay, 
so we're just gonna go really quickly. I deleted all the warps, so it's still gonna take me to the map, but it's gonna take me right in the middle. So now I talk to him, he says, yo, 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 home slice in the hood. How's it going? How are you? No any good stories? Pie is good. See that? See how it, um, see how it moves down and the top line is still there and then it clears everything? So that's how that works, guys. And I'm just gonna show you a script really quickly up here. The one I use, like, this is my test script for when I found out how to make characters disappear for trainer battles. Watch. And he leaves. Epic, eh? I know. I know. So, uh, I hope this tutorial was helpful, guys. Next time, I will do whatever I feel like doing. Maybe some more scripting, maybe some more advanced map stuff. So, rate, comment, subscribe for more tutorials, guys. I'll see you, I'll see you later.